Hello, and welcome to Chips and Salsa, where we talk security at Intel. I'm Jerry. I'm Krobe. Hey, Krobe, do you know what time it is? Well, actually, Jerry, I do, yes. Hey, I got it this month. It's Patch Tuesday. Actually, Jerry, let's do it the right way. It's Uh, Patch Tuesday. (laughs) Yes, it's Patch Tuesday yet again. And on March 12th, Intel will be releasing our 2024.1 Intel platform update that contains eight security advisories addressing 12 vulnerabilities. And. For those playing at home, we're glad to report that this month we had 100% of the vulnerabilities that are being disclosed were found either through Intel's proactive product security and assurance programs internally or through things like our bug bounty programs. So yay, security research. Yeah. For those interested in our security assurance programs, you should check out the 2023 Intel product security report where we review the year of activities related to our world-class capabilities. That's right. Hey, uh, you know what my, our friends, the Patch Hats say, Jerry? What's that? They say it's a great read. So read uh, that PSR. We also did a Chips and Salsa review of it uh, recently where you can get the TLDR. So uh, back to these advisories, Crow. Right. Well, with those 12 advisories disclosed this month, we have CVSS scores ranging from 3.2, which is low, all the way up to 7.2, which is high. 67% of these were internally found by Intelers, and our bug bounty program reports discovered the other 33%. Again, bringing that back up to that awesome number of 100% for all the volumes disclosed this month. Good job, team. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, The IPU advisory uh, released today covers uh, firmware, uh, BIOS, and microcode. As normal, Intel recommends that customers review the advisories and associated data and apply the relevant latest updates that uh, all should be available today from Intel and our ecosystem partners. That's a great point, Jerry. And um, one advisory to take note of that has some additional collateral being released alongside it is Intel SA00898. This advisory describes a potential security vulnerability in the bus lock regulator mechanism in some Intel processors that may allow denial of service. It's referred to as uh, RFDS and was internally found by Intel researchers. So that there's additional collabor- uh, collateral in the form of a technical paper that's been prepared to help provide additional information about the vulnerability. Yeah, and as we wind down for this month, we share a short list of our system manufacturing partners Uh, who also may have additional advisories releasing this March. So please visit the link for the full list of support sites. Right. And I I think Jerry Patch Hat's telling us, happy patching, and we'll see you next time.